I'm going to give a brief explanation of what card counting is and how it is done. Many people think you have to memorize every card that is played and keep it in your head and it is not. What it is is you give the small cards a value of plus one. In many systems a two through a seven is give you just count it as a plus one. The eights and nines you ignore and the tens and aces you give as a minus one. So this is a hand after it is played where the dealer's cards and three players and to card count, you would look at this person's hand and you would go one, two, three. The nine is a zero. You would look here, you would go four, five. The ten and the four would cancel the zero. This would be six. The ten and the six would cancel the zero. This would be seven. So after this hand is played, you would have what is called a running count of plus seven. Now, in a single deck or a double deck, that is a very good number. It means, as you can see here, a percentage of cards, a lot of the small cards are out of play and there's still a lot of tens and particularly aces left in the deck. When you see something like this, on your next hand you would increase your bet because on that hand you would expect more tens and aces to fall. So you're not memorizing all these cards, you're only memorizing the count. The count is plus seven. When the dealer takes these away and starts the next hand, you just place out a bigger bet and you would expect more tens and aces to fall.